Hey, warrior friends, welcome back. We are discussing chapter six in our story, Secret of the Silver Key. Now you may have noticed by now that there's a reoccurring pattern in our story. In every chapter, our main character, Fribble, goes to the library to do some research and to find facts and information. In our last chapter, Fribble went to the library and used a card catalog, and he found out about the Dewey Decimal System. Melville Dewey, an American librarian pictured here, uh, came up with a number system that organized topics together on our shelves. And he decided that if we could put topics that are similar topics together on the shelf, it'd make it easier for people to find the books they're interested in. So he came up with a system that has 10 sections in it. Each section has a different number, like the zeros, the 100s, the 200s, the 300s, all the way up to the 900s. In Melville Dewey's system of numbers, 500s are the numbers that we use for science books. Um, <clears throat> planets are going to have the number 525. Weather is going to have the number 551. And mammals are going to have a number like 599. <clears throat> Here on our library shelves, you can see these numbers posted in a couple different places. Some of our numbers are posted on these blue stickers. And some of our numbers are posted on these white boxes. You can use these numbers to help you find the books that you're interested in. So how does the Dewey Decimal System help you? Well, number one, you need to know that the Dewey Decimal System is used in almost all libraries. You'll find the Dewey Decimal System in our nonfiction section here at the Wilson Elementary School Library. You'll find the Dewey Decimal System at the Hayes Public Library. You also need to know that you don't have to memorize all of the Dewey Decimal numbers, but you do need to know how it works. You need to understand the system. Please understand that um, books that, are, that have the same topic are going to have the same number. So all of the dog books are going to have the same number. All the books about tornadoes are going to have the same number and will be on the shelf together. The books are all in number order, starting with the smallest number, 0, and then going to the highest number, 999. Let's try it out. Let's work together on our card catalog and see if we can find out what the Dewey Decimal number is for some topics that you're interested in. <laughs> 